In this video, I'm going to measure the temperature of the infrared side burner on my Napoleon Prestige 500 grill. And my setup consists of four Type K thermocouples that are going to measure the temperature and a four channel data logger over here that I'm going to read the temperatures and record. So the grate has four thermocouples on it. It has a grate temperature right here in the rear, an air temperature in the middle, another grate temperature, and then there's a thermocouple that's tough to see down at the source of the infrared burner. Like I said, I've cooked on this several times. It gets hot. I love it. I just want to see how hot it really gets. So let's find out. Let's get this guy lit up. Okay, there we go. So you can see the two great temperatures are much lower. The air temperature is already 600 F and the infrared heat coming off that burner is already at 1720. Not exactly 1800, but let's give it a few minutes here and see how it does. Well, it seems to be climbing fairly well. Great temperatures are coming up to what the air temperature is. Not exactly 1800, but I'd say 1720-ish is very hot. Well, fortunately for us, we actually have a timer in the background, so I'll have to make a note of that. After a few minutes, now you're getting the glowing red. There it is. Glowing orange. Let's see where we're at. Now oh, it's climbing a little bit. We'll log some beta. Those great temperatures have a little bit of a delta, but not much. Great temperature is starting to come up. The higher temperature is the forward metal temperature. The lower one is the aft metal temperature. What I've learned so far is whenever I am going to sear something, it's five to 600 degrees is about tops. So you don't want to go too much more than that. So burner's been on for roughly four minutes and there you go. Your great temperatures are up there at 650, 560. And that burner is kind of maxed out at 1760-ish. So there you have it. 
That's how hot the infrared side burner gets on a Napoleon Prestige 500 grill. Here is an update. So I've let this go for well over five minutes. I think we're eight minutes into it. And it's really trying to get to 1800. So it's getting awfully close. Can't complain about plus or minus 10 degrees. And look at those great temperatures now. Oh, that's hot. Yeah, that's cast iron. It's going to hold that heat. And that is going to sear up anything you put on that grate. This is not a normal side burner. It's amazing. 